くんですね。For a look into your energy saving future, spend a day with Noboko Masuzawa. The Japanese housewife sorts her trash into recycling categories. Not one, not two, not three, but ten. She avoids using plastic bags and runs her household on electricity generated from her own solar panels. We've been recycling for a long time. I never thought it was very special. Masuzawa is typical in Japan, a country where recycling is practically a civic duty and saving energy a national obsession. We are an island and lack a lot of natural resources like oil. We should refrain from living a wasteful lifestyle. We need to recycle. People in some parts of the country separate their trash into as many as 43 categories, from newspapers and magazines to plastic bottles, cans, cosmetics cases, used batteries, milk cartons, and styrofoam trays. Clothes get recycled too. One of the hot new trends these days is to take a class on how to turn an old shirt, a set of pajamas, even a broken umbrella, into a brand new shopping bag. People bring new life to their old clothes and reduce the use of plastic bags. It's doubly effective. The Japanese government says the lack of domestic oil has helped motivate businesses here to develop things like hybrid electric cars and solar panels, such as the ones attached to Masuzawa's roof. When the weather is good, we can sell electricity to the local electric company. It's like I'm running my own power station. Even food has its right place. So, what does Masuzawa think of people who don't recycle? <laughs> It's unforgivable. We need to abide by the rules. And in a country which cherishes order and conformity, collective guilt helps feed the recycling craze, too.